Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, fans of our agents, what's poppin'? I made establishment townsy bringing y'all yet another live reaction to My Hero Academia. Boku no Hero Academia, we got chapter number 254 this time around. Last chapter, look, our little four, our little four month time skip came to an end. I was hoping we got to see some other people, but it's like, dang, man. It's fine. Last time we literally only got Deku. Well, uh -huh, they, they went on a mission or whatever. So last time well, on the actual training, training, we only got Deku uh, and, and the people that went on a mission. But we got like actual training this time. We got Shoto. We got Bakugo. So we literally got those two at least learning more things. Hoping we got to see others, but it's like, to really do others, that would have to be so much. Like with the uh, class 1A versus class 1B, that little arc, or the train, the class 1, the joint training arc, whatever you want to call it. That I did not expect three chapters on every fight. I, now, my, I didn't mind it. That was hella chapters. <laughs> it was hella chapters, so it's like, to try to do something like that with all of these, to get one chapter each, that would be, damn, that would have been hella chapters. They give everybody a solo dolo chapter. He could have gave everybody a half chapter. That's a lot of chapters thinking about it. A lot of chapters. Dang, think about it. If he would have started going through that, there's no way people would have been satisfied. <laughs> I mean, I do. I, I don't think I would have cared, but it would have been no way most people would have been satisfied with that. I can understand the decision, to just not. <laughs> I can understand. And so we got a color page. Wait, we got a clean color page. It's definitely got to do with the movie. But this is a clean look color page. The new movie hits the big screens on Friday, December the 20th in Japan. It's time. Hey, I got to see this movie. Also, I got to see, I got to see the old movie too. I have not. I'm thinking about, you know what I'm saying? Do a little live stream on that one. I'll let y'all know. I'll let y'all know. Just like I do plan on doing that vigilante, okay? Them live streams is coming in January. Got to get caught up. Look, clearly it's important. Got to get caught up. Speaking of important, this chapter's important. It's time. You know your boy's impatient? I already read the first page. <laughs> Woo! This color page. Oh, this is the top ten. Yeah, I was seeing this on Twitter. Your boy Bakugo number one. Hey, look at your boy. The top ten, the popularity content assemble. It might be time. We got Bakugo, Momo, Aizawa. Shigaraki was way like way lower than I thought he was gonna be. He's like number seven or something like that. But I mean. I don't think my the MVA was done at that point in time. My Villain Academy, I don't think that was done at that point in time. So maybe that's why. Hold on, Deku looking okay. Deku, okay. I thought I don't know why I thought that was like his actual suit, but nah, they this is for the uh, color pair. I'm like, dang, he looking kind of clean right now, boy. I mean, maybe it is. I'm good. I'm saying maybe it is. Well, maybe that's what it looks like now, colored. If so, I mean, hey, that's high key kind of heat. <laughs> high key kind of heat. I just realized. Everybody's number is imbued somewhere in him. Bakugo has the number one on his shoulder. Shoto has the number three on his wrist. Aizawa has seven on his shoulder. Momo, ten on her titties. Okay, so now we're looking at Aizawa's friend or whoever that was who ends up being Kurogiri. I don't know. Look, this is the reason why I'm like, hold on. I've seen, I read, I'm saying, I read Vigilantes, you know what I'm saying? I got about like, you know, maybe 10 chapters in, I just didn't finish. I, it's not that I didn't like it, I just didn't finish, you know what I'm saying? And he's like, as long as the three of us stick together, sure, Muko Oboro lost his life when we were interning together. Dang, there's not a problem in the world we can't resolve. So this was his partner. The three of us were planning the three. Oh, present Mike too. So there was all a little squad. Oh, that's why they were so emotional. Look, well, I already knew, you know what I'm saying? We already knew, uh, halfway already knew that Aizawa was, you know what I'm saying, feeling some type of way for some reason. But that's why President Mike was just so mad last chapter. Like, I was like, why is President Mike mad? But this is why that was about to be a little squad, bro. This is gonna found their own agency? Like I said, Shota would take care of all the details for us. The incident that happened shortly afterwards, and we'll never fight over money, I. Right? <laughs> he was caught under a collapsing building and an all too early death. Dang. Long ago, we all aimed to be heroes together, back when we were all UA students. In other words, there's a high probability that Kurogiri is a nomu. <laughs> Yo, people was low key saying that, and like I was when like I didn't believe or not believe, but people was low key saying that. Kuro Gumi, like uh, Kuro Giri, the Nomu constructed with Shirakumo's body at its base. You know, they used to call us the Three Stooges of Class A. 
I still don't get what you're talking about. The most exceptional quirks are gathered together at UA, as there's only one logical conclusion. Wait, is he actually talking right now, right now, right now? Like a homeless man scrounging for scraps behind a three-star restaurant. He most likely switched out the corpse before the cremation process and turned him into the deranged beast you know now as Noma. Don't bother trying to understand, DJ. There is nothing to understand. Only evil. He's like, I just don't get it. He's sleeping right now. Otherwise, he'd try to use his quirk. So why us in particular? Don't tell me you're hoping for some miracle using the power of friendship. <laughs> so we just talking shit on fairy tale now. Real life isn't some shonen movie. It you can't just do this. You can't just do this. With the proper explanations in place, miracles become possibilities. The normal that Endeavor beat it in Kyushu clearly possessed a sense of individuality, as well as a lingering obsession with strong opponents. After examining the DNA of its burnt corpse, we've discovered that its original body was a ruffian from an underground fight club. Oh, that makes sense. He wanted stronger people? That's how this dude probably was, a fight club. It's not like he's just fighting for money. It's a club, he obviously fighting for money. But it's like, that's what he likes to do, clearly. So his original character may have remained intact. Unfortunately, I've already fought against him once at UA. Not only his way of speaking different, but he didn't react at all when we fought. But yeah, his character may have been intact then, but he may also have just been moving in based on erased or modified memories. Like I said before, if we can get him to talk somehow, everything might become clear. Erase your head, present Mike. I'd like you two to reawaken Shirakumo Oboro's resolve. Is that possible? I mean, we haven't seen a Nomu go traitor. I guess, you know what I'm saying? We haven't seen that, so it's like, is that possible? Is that a thing? You know what I'm saying? Or do they just control the Nomu just straight up? And now they're sitting face to face with one another, so you're telling us just talk about our memories, please. <laughs> what about his family? If you two aren't enough, then... And so he, he closed his eyes, because you know they, they know he's enough. Oh, he started using his quirk? If I let you tell his family anything about this. Okay, yeah, no, okay, okay. He said, I got this. He said, if we ain't enough, he they was gonna try to pull the family next. He said, nope, can't do it, brother. And then erase her head, staring at him with them eyes. He's awake, placeholder, please begin. Okay, it's time. Oh, what rare guest? I haven't seen y'all two since we attacked you, eh? Uh, the mist don't disappear, even with eraser looking at him, which means his body itself is made up of that stuff. Y'all sure I ain't get something wrong? He ain't got nothing in common with Shirakumo. Shigaraki Tamura. Is he doing all right? He ain't been caught yet, has he? Like, as if I know. Ah, uh, too bad. Are you concerned about Shigaraki? Indeed. It's my mission to look over him. Well, that's a dumb man. <laughs> like, well, that's a dumbass mission. What kind of mission is to overlook some gloomy old brat? He's just screaming mad. Eh, it's no burden to me whatsoever. After all, I can't just let him be. And then so he raised his head just looking. Oh, man, do he, re <laughs> Did he realize? He's like, oh, man. He was the type of guy who would go out of his way without hesitation to pick up the abandoned kitten that I couldn't pick up. Oh man, so he might be slowly realizing, he might be slowly realizing, I don't see your point. What are you here to do? No reaction. I was the type of guy who would always be hesitating. What? What? I mean, he thinks about everything though, so it just makes sense. So you're Aizawa Shota? I'm Shirakumo. Nice to meet you, Shota. Shota, hurry up, they're running out of seats at the cafeteria. But despite that, here, I'll lend you my goggles. Now you ain't gotta worry about your eyes when you fight. Look, we match. We're all, you're all, oh, wait, wait. I was, I was playing about the goggles last time. Hold on, they, they, the goggles really a thing. He really gave them, that's fire. Look, we match. You were always pulling me forward. You sure you got the right place? This ain't a church. You're always so bright, always looking ahead. Always without ever considering those consequences, man. And you slowly see like, like the oh, I like this paneling. Like you can slowly see him slowly getting more depressed, thinking. I think he stopped using his quirk, even though everything would be over if you died. And they, oh man, they looking at when the bridge collapsed. It's raining everything, and he he's wobbling. Is the is the smoke wobbling or is he shaking because he remembered? You know, both Yamada and I are teachers now. I've been really strict with the students. He's talking about his ex distinguishedly high exposure count, huh? Only on paper. Mm -hmm. And then you see a question mark. Hey, did you see? 
Eric Sensei just ran out with a real mean look on his face. Don't he always got a mean look? Nah, this one's way meaner than usual. Like how he looked when he expelled us. So, not as mean as we, we expelled us. <laughs> God, I still got nightmares about that now. I thought it was all over for me. Wait, who is this? Wait, who is this? Maybe, but when I think I've really grown as a result, don't you think? No way. For a warning lesson, exposure is going way too far. Thanks to his antics, everyone is too, everyone in 2A is going to have that in our permanent records, you know? You want the ability to expel and re-enroll students? Yes. self sac Okay, so this must be when Nezu gave him the power to expel and... Okay. The self-sacrifice and recklessness are very different concepts. But in order for those headstrong students to learn this, I like for them to experience death once. So getting expelled is death. And okay. And then coming back for that retribution gonna make you stronger like he just said doing so will also push them to strive even higher he's talking to nezu right now well freedom is the founding philosophy of ua after all i wanted you i wanted heroes who could pull others forward like you could to be able to live even longer and then kurogiri is like squinting shirakumo if by any chance you're still in there and then he's still squinting oh he's crying bro let's all become heroes together his friend of long past, right before his eyes. But will his voice reach him? Number 254 in. Now I, I am very curious about like that little shutter shake that Kurogumi did. He raised the head was in a way kind of like Sunny D. He wasn't depressed, but you know what I'm saying? He always took everything into account. He always thought, thought and thought before his actions. There was that, he, he, he helped me be able to do that. He helped homie, you know what I mean, with the goggles. He, like with inspiration and all that, they was gonna become heroes. We could uh, be, uh, make a whole office together, my guy. Dang! So he really would have been like Izawa might have low key really been out here, you know what I'm saying? If, if they would have had their little team in, but you know what I'm saying? The third dude was gone, so they they became teachers. But like, it makes sense. It makes it like, damn. He wanted to bring people up just like Homeboy brought him up. That's wild. And it's like I really. I know. So that means that Shirakumo's quirk was like uh, the portal quirk? Or which which part was this quirk? I think they might have said it last chapter. I gotta go back. But even then, what other quirks does this dude have? Do he have more than one quirk? That's an interesting look. They ain't said nothing yet. And I'm looking at it now. One of these guards, he got like a Shitetsu hat on. Is this, is this a Shitetsu teacher or something like that? We got teachers here right now. <laughs> look, we got three. We got teachers here dying right now. This might be a Shitetsu teacher. But Aizawa, that's the like, dang. I mean, you get it though. This is homeboy. This is best friend. This is dude. This is squad gang, man. I wonder if these tears is gonna reach him, dog. I'm wondering. I just don't. I kind of don't expect it to. Let's not, to be real. It's cool that we learned all this, but I kind of don't expect it to work. If it do work, like if it do work, hey, you know what I'm saying, hey. But like, I'm not really expecting it to. I'm really excited for next chapter. Dog, my hero's been on a hot streak this year. 1A versus 1B, the normal fight. I don't think the no one and Endeavor fight was this year, but whatever. The 1A versus 1B, my villain academia, all that was heat. I'm assuming this arc, oh, 2020 for my hero, 2020 for my hero, 2020 for my hero, dog. I've been saying it for like yearly sales. I think, I think my hero is going to do it. I think so. Like, if the arc is as clean as it might be promised to be, my hero might do it. Demon Slayer may or may not have done it this year. I don't know. I don't care. Uh, the one website says one thing, while uh, 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 Shonen Jump says something else. So it's like, I don't fucking know. I don't care. I think my hero is going to definitively take out One Piece. Not not a, of overall sales, just yearly, you know what I'm saying? For 2020, not 2020 specifically, but like in the next few years. I think it's going to happen. Things gonna happen. I can't wait for these next chapters, dog. My hero's gonna go crazy in 2020. But as far as this live reaction goes, it's pretty much all I got for y'all this time around. So like I always say, leave a like, comment, subscribe, pull up to the Twitch stream, pull up to the Discord. Y'all have a good one.